Assalamu alaikum and hi. Alhamdulillah, we have managed to list down all the hypothetical combination successfully. So now I'm going to give you an extra point. Okay, extra knowledge. Because sometimes question not only they ask about the hypothetical combination, but they do ask also the values of those combinations. So this is the values. And the unit of the values is milliequivalent per liter. So how do we do that? Okay. So if we can see the first combination that we have is calcium bicarbonate. So this is my ruler. This is the area for calcium bicarbonate. You can see the concentration is 1.45. And that's why it's being written there, 1.45. The next one that we have is magnesium bicarbonate. So I have two rulers right now. This is the magnesium bicarbonate area. So we can see the concentration is 2.79 minus 1.45. And that is the concentration of magnesium 1.34 so that value is 1.34 and the next one we have is sodium bicarbonate so this is the area for sodium bicarbonate okay so 2.81 minus 2.79 and that concentration is 0 0.02 right and the next one, we have sodium sulfate. So this is this area for sodium sulfate. As you can see, sodium and sulfate. So 3.56 minus 2.81. Essentially, that is the concentration of sulfate that we have calculated. And that is 0 0.75. Okay. The next one is sodium chloride okay 3.79 minus 3.56 so i need to use calculator this time around 3.79 minus 3.56 and that is 0 0.23 and that the value is 0 0.23 and the last one is potassium chloride and that is 4.24 minus 3.79. Essentially, that is the concentration of potassium ion. And that is 0 0.45. 0 0.45. So this is what we call as the values of the hypothetical combination. Thank you from Muzaffar.